what is up everybody you know what i got in the mail today this thing vitopal vm i2 it's a little microphone uh, phone holder tripod kit and thought well i should do a little review so today we're gonna do a unboxing of this thing and i'm also gonna try out how it sounds and you can sew it for yourself is it any good is it not anyways let's get to it Oh wow, this is actually very beautiful and it's also sort of a hard case, so wow, so pretty. All right, so what do we have here? First of all, we have the thing where we hold the microphone. So this one is for the camera and this one is a cable for a smartphone this is really cool because you can actually uh, connect it with both with your phone and with your camera i'm gonna read this letter and in this kit yeah we also have a tripod this little tripod feels uh, plasticky but of course it doesn't have to hold um, 100 kilograms all of these parts are plastic as well but I'm pretty sure it's gonna do its job hopefully well and here a drum roll please we have the most important thing hopefully the phone holder which is really nice and a dead cat wow this is so fluffy and the microphone itself is right here it's actually really good because it comes with uh, this fluffy thing that you can leave it on all the time you don't have to put the the dead cat uh, on all the time based on my experience you have to be very careful not to break this and this is probably one of the things that these manufacturers could improve this is very much stiff plastic. Um, I don't think anyone comes near to Rode's video mics where they have this sort of rubbery feeling and it actually moves. And I have to put quite a lot of force in order to move this. So this shock mount uh, definitely is not one of the best. Um, and I haven't seen any other manufacturer do make it better than Rode. Um, so that's one thing that anyone else could improve making this much much softer so uh, for you not to break this thing because i've seen a lot of other microphones don't just put it on like this because this part will break so what you actually have to do is kind of have to put your um, finger underneath so you give some support and then you just squeeze it in you saw how i was holding it here um, so the microphone is in I mean this is actually not that bad it actually uh, moves quite a lot uh, which is good you want these things to be as soft as possible and here yeah here we have the phone holder that looks very sturdy I mean it's all plastic but it looks very very sturdy I'm able to put the phone in here vertical and horizontal position which is really cool um, and then that can go on the tripod and we also have the hot shoe mount here on the holder on the side very nice and that's what's in the box um, so let's check it out how it looks with everything set up and how it sounds as well so yeah, this is how it looks like when it's all set up. Um, the, uh, the tripod is, as I said before, uh, it's quite sturdy for your phone and probably you could put some lighter mirrorless camera. But let's talk about this microphone, uh, a little bit of uh, the performance, and uh, let's talk about the pros, the cons, and yeah, some improvements that, that, that could be done. First of all, the sound is actually quite nice and obviously if the microphone comes closer to your mouth 
then obviously the sound is much better uh, as opposed to when it's really really far then yeah the sound is not always the best but it's still very much usable uh, and actually when you are uh, vlogging this is approximately the distance you would be having from the the camera um, or for, from your phone I mean this is like the length uh, distance um, and yeah I mean it is way more sensitive than my other microphone so I had to actually decrease the levels which is really good and also please note that my room is absolutely horrible when it comes to soundproofing I have a very very basic um, some sound blankets uh, on the opposite side of the wall but this the street is pretty loud and it's also rainy and wet so you can actually hear a lot of cars and the room is also quite big so um, yeah you have a lot of ambient noise and that you will get with almost any microphone uh, unless you have like this very very big shotgun mic um, so on a, on a pro side I would say that the sound for my ears is, is quite good uh, it picks up the audio very well so the pattern for this microphone is also quite good because you see I'm uh, turning the microphone against me right now and the sound is picked up very well and if I turn it away then you kind of don't hear me that well anymore which is really good that means that uh, from here from outside of the front of the microphone the sound is not being picked up um, and ex that's exactly what you want so the build quality of this microphone the microphone itself seems very nice um, I, I think it's like metal um, and the connection is very sturdy very strong so all of the things are you know as they are supposed to be the the whole setup for your phone and all other things are plasticky but that seems like quite sturdy plastic and as again you probably wouldn't be putting too many uh, kilograms on it so you shouldn't you know um, worry too much about it and obviously you're not paying a, a extremely premium price to expect all metal and extremely uh, sturdy things so uh, I think for what you're paying this this is quite uh, decent this shock mount is much better than uh, that I have in on my other microphone because it actually moves and uh, it allows some movement for for the microphone but it unfortunately is made of plastic and it's not made of uh, this rubber material which means that it transmits the sound uh, quite well so let me let me demonstrate if I would if I ever use this uh, a tripod as you know holding in my hand then you can actually hear all the sounds if if I'm like sliding my hand or or hitting the any part of this um, setup then you will clearly uh, hear all of the sounds so check this out for example I mean it is not extremely extremely noticeable and it's not like it's the end of the world in a normal circumstances you see I'm, I'm I'm holding it in my hand I'm moving around I'm not making almost any noises but if I were to put it on the table or if I you know want to set it up then obviously you are hearing a lot of noise and a lot of uh, disturbance so for me this is kind of I don't know if I if I should say that's a con or um, just a, a place you know where it could be improved so yeah um, other than that it comes with a lot of features you can use it with your phone you can use it with your camera there's a dead cat it works pretty well outside in the wind um, this is also very useful because you can turn your phone all the sides it has the hot shoe mount you can put it on your camera you can put it on this thing the phone holder um, of course the the tripod also goes all the ways and as I said if you are doing this um, from the distance that that you would be doing your vlogs the sound is quite nice considering that this room is absolutely uh, garbage in, in, in terms of uh, soundproofing so yeah guys uh, go check it out this microphone I'm not sure what the price will be in your location um, but if you if you get it for a good deal I think it's totally worth this microphone because um, I mean I've tested it in, in a couple of environments works very well I'm very satisfied with it except those couple of things that I mentioned 
but again you are not paying an absolute premium price over 100 or 200 dollars so uh, this is what you expect so for the price that you're paying i actually think this is uh, quite a good deal that you can get yeah uh, the link is in the description of course as always go check it out if you want um, and i will guys see you in some other video that is coming up very soon thanks for watching see you guys bye